Leon Trotsky, a letter to James P. Cannon, from September 12, 1939. Dear Jim, I am writing now a study on the social character of the USSR in connection with the war question. The writing with its translation will take at least one week. The fundamental ideas are as follows. 1. Our definition of the USSR can be right or wrong, but I do not see any reason to make this definition dependent on the German-Soviet pact. 2. The social character of the USSR is not determined by her friendship with democracy or fascism. Who adopts such a point of view becomes a prisoner of the Stalinist conception of the People's Front epoch. 3. Who says that the USSR is no more a degenerated worker state but a new social formation should clearly say what he adds to our political conclusions? 4. The USSR question cannot be isolated as unique from the whole historic process of our times. Either the Stalin state is a transitory formation, it is a transformation of a worker state in a backward and isolated country, or, quote, bureaucratic collectivism is a new formation which is replacing capitalism throughout the world, Stalinism, fascism, New Deals, etc., the terminological experiments, worker state, not worker state, class, not class, etc., receive a sense only under this historic e aspect. Who chooses the second alternative admits openly or silently that all the revolutionary potentialities of the world proletariat are exhausted, that the socialist movement is bankrupt, and that the old capitalism is transforming itself into, quote, bureaucratic collectivism with a new exploiting class. The tremendous importance of such a conclusion is self-explanatory. It concerns the whole fate of the world proletariat and mankind. We have, have we the slightest right to induce ourselves by purely terminological experiments in a new historic conception which occurs to be in an absolute contradiction with our program, strategy, and tactics? Such an adventuristic jump would be doubly criminal now in view of the world war when the perspective of the socialist revolution becomes an imminent reality and when the case of the USSR will appear to everybody as a transitorial episode in the process of world socialist revolution. I hope these, excuse me, I write these lines in haste, which explains their insufficiency, but in a week I hope to send you my more complete thesis. Comradely, greetings, VTO, bracket, Leon Trotsky, end bracket. Footnote. Because of the conditions of his residence in the various countries in which he lived after his exile, Trotsky often used pseudonyms in his letters. Trotsky's letters were frequently signed with the name of his English secretary.